Hi, I am Hema and in this video I am going to do question number 5 of exercise 11.2 NCRT class 9th mathematics. Here the question is, construct a right triangle whose base is 12 cm and sum of its hypotenuse and other side is 18 cm. Let us first draw a rough figure. So here we have to draw a right triangle. Let this triangle be A, B and C where base BC is equal to 12 cm and sum of its hypotenuse that is AC in the figure and the other side which is AB is equal to 18 cm. That means AB plus AC is equal to 18 cm centimeters okay so now let us do the construction first we'll draw bc so let us first draw bc equal to 12 centimeters now we'll construct 90 degree angle at b with the help of compass so place your compass at b and with any convenient radius draw an arc which touches the line bc we will place this compass at this point and draw two arcs cutting the previously drawn arc at two different points. Let these two points be M and N. Now to get 90 degree angle, we will bisect this arc MN. With N as center, draw an arc. Now with the same radius, place your compass at M and with M as center, draw another arc cutting this arc. Now from B, we will draw a ray which passes through this point of intersection of the two arcs. So this ray is ray BX. Now we are given that AB plus AC is equal to 18 centimeters. So we will place the compass at B. And open the compass equal to 18 centimeters and cut this ray BX. Uh, let this point be point D. Now it will be difficult for you all to open the compass equal to 18 centimeters. So you can mark this point D with the help of scale and then draw an arc with the compass. Join DC. Now the third vertex of the triangle ABC that is A will lie somewhere on this ray BX. To find this point on the ray BX, we'll have to draw a perpendicular bisector of CD and the point where this perpendicular bisector will intersect this ray BX will be the point A that is the vertex A of the triangle ABC. So let us draw a perpendicular bisector of CD. So place your compass at point C and radius greater than half of CD will draw two arcs above and below the line CD. Now with the same radius, we will place the compass at point D and cut the two arcs drawn previously above and below the line CD. Now let these two points of intersection be E, F. Join E, F to get the perpendicular bisector of C, D. So the perpendicular bisector E, F intersects the ray B, X at this point. And so this point is the third vertex of the triangle A, B, C that is vertex A. Join AC to complete the triangle ABC. Hence, ABC is the required triangle. So now let us do the justification and see how this triangle ABC is the required triangle. Now in this triangle ABC, base BC is equal to 12 centimeters and angle B 
is equal to 90 degrees. Okay. And we need to prove that AB plus AC is equal to 18 centimeters. That is the sum of its hypotenuse and the other side is 18 centimeters. We know that this point, that is the vertex A, lies on the perpendicular bisector EF. Therefore, A will be at equal distance from D and C. So, we can say that AD is equal to AC. And from the figure, we can also say that BD is equal to AB plus AD. Okay, now AD here is equal to AC. So, in place of AD, we can write down AC. And hence, we can say that BD is equal to AB plus AC. And since BD is equal to 18 centimeters by construction, so we can say that AB plus AC is equal to 18 centimeters. Hence, triangle ABC is the required triangle. I hope this construction is very clear to you. And if you have any doubt, you can ask me in the comment section below. It will be my pleasure to help you with your doubts. Thank you.